things are occurring at the same night the blue moon and the red moon and super moon and the lunar eclipse it is very amazing to see it first time for me and what interests you in sun uh it's the super moon which uh, super moon blue moon and total lunar eclipse all in one so super moon is when the moon in its elliptical path comes closest to the earth so that's called the perigee point and that's uh, that was actually uh, sometime yesterday so it's almost the closest the moon will come to us so it's it just appears a lot larger and brighter so that's a super moon and a blue moon as you might have heard you know once in a blue moon it's a uh, it just means the second full moon in a month so because the moon's lunar cycle is 29.5 days it rarely happens that two full moons happen in a month so this is the this is a rare month when it is happening uh, and that's also today but that doesn't show as blue it's just called blue moon and then we have the main event which is the total lunar eclipse today and so because the moon is bigger and brighter it's going to look uh, it's going to look great when we can see it and uh, the total lunar eclipse actually makes the moon look red red or copperish as as they're saying yeah why exactly so actually uh, what happens is uh, uh, the way the eclipse happens is uh, the moon is blocked by the earth so the, it's a, it's a straight line the sun the earth and then the moon so the earth shadow completely covers the moon when it's uh, when it's in this total lunar eclipse phase so it's got no light of its own so uh, the way we see the light is the light that's reflected off the earth and because the earth is blocking it what happens is the sun's light comes into the earth's atmosphere and then is refracted so the blue light gets refracted away and the red light gets refracted towards the moon and it looks red and uh, actually like you pointed out at some point in this eclipse when it just starts there will also be a blue rim and why do, why is there a blue rim it's actually a special special refraction it's the ozone layer which you all have heard about because ozone layer prevents us from uh, you know harmful radiation that layer actually refracts the uh, red it actually refract refracts the blue light towards it so for a little while we get to see the a blue rim and then the most of the time it's going to look like a red red moon so do you think the rim